what's up y'all welcome back to another video if you're new here subscribe because you're already here and the button is right down there so just click it sorry in advance if you hear stuff i think the garbage men are outside right now i don't know but i hear some some truck outside so sorry if you hear stuff in the background i'm gonna be doing a review on a strapless bra for like plus size or larger chested ladies so a little while ago i was looking for a strapless bra online because my current one I don't know like I don't know I just didn't like it I still like I don't know I wasn't feeling that I feel like I need a new one I needed more support the lighting is changing as well because the sun's going down I don't know what the fuck's going on sorry okay I always have problems when I'm filming um maybe I should turn another light on we'll get through it <laughs> hopefully that's better um but yeah so I was looking for a strapless bra because I didn't like mine anymore and you know how when you look up stuff Facebook knows and they'll like put ads and stuff that you were looking up on you know your Facebook so I seen an ad hold on so I seen an ad for a strapless bra from a company called bra Braola, Braola. I don't know how to pronounce it I'm gonna put the name on the screen so it popped up on my Facebook and it was advertised as a bandeau which if you're like a larger girl or you have larger boobs you know like a bandeau don't do shit. But I seen the price, I'm like, oh, this is only $24. Like, what? Um, so I went on YouTube to see if there was like anybody else who had purchased this bra and see what their comments were about it. And there were a few people who did actually purchase the same bra I'm gonna be reviewing. And to be honest, it didn't look like it was a lot of support for the girls who videos I watched. It just it didn't seem like it held them up but then i'm like it's only 24 dollars, and i don't like the strapless bra i have now i feel like it doesn't give me enough support either so why not try it i feel like strapless bras for bigger girls like they're always like sliding down through the night hella spillage like all this spillage it doesn't never cover what it's supposed to cover and it's just like uncomfortable because you're constantly throughout the night pulling it up and like i like to wear it when i go out when i wear like you know cute little strapless dresses and I don't want to be uncomfortable feeling, thinking I'm cute going out and I feel uncomfortable because I have to keep pulling up my bra. Even though it doesn't have a lot of support, I thought like I'd rather be more comfortable than have like extra support. That's just me. I'm all about comfortability. So I purchased a size 2X in this bra. I was going to get a 3X, but the girl's video who I had watched, she was a 46 triple D and I'm a 44 triple D. So I figured, and she got a 2X, so I figured I should get a 2X. Um, just cause I feel like maybe if it's tighter, then it'll fit better as well. I don't know, I just got the size cause she got, she got it and she wore like, you know, almost the same size as me. I'm gonna show you guys the bra. This is what it looks like, hold up. I don't know what's front and what's back. Here we go. This is the bra. So you see why it's called a bandeau. And it's very small, I'm not gonna lie. But it actually does have underwire in it. So that's where you get, you know, the support from. But it does have underwire. Um, and it's a very soft and stretchy material. I'm gonna try it on so you guys can see what it looks like on. I haven't tried it on yet, so it's gonna be my first time seeing what it looks like. And also I'm gonna see how it looks under a dress. Um, but at first I'm gonna try it on without anything. Just, damn, hold it. At the time I hear up, y'all. That would actually fit. I thought it was about to be. Let me adjust myself. So this is what it looks like. It obviously does have a lot of support, but I like how it covers my rolls in the back too. Um, a lot of strapless bras don't do that, so that's another good thing about this. And to be honest, I don't think it looks terribly bad. I'm kind of glad I got a 2X. It's really, really stretchy. They just don't give you an extra lift, but 
Like my strap is probably sliding down anyways, so my shit probably be looking like this anyways. But it's super comfortable. I feel like I could like wear this under like any shirt um, and be fine just cause it's like honestly comfortable as fuck. Like I could live in this bra. I just love the back too. Like it's really, it's really covering everything. But um, I have to go grab a dress cause I don't have a dress in this room. It's in my um, like little dressing room. So I'm gonna go grab a dress so I can see what it looks like under, so I can see what the bra looks like under a dress. I'll be right back. So this is a dress from my ASOF haul, if you guys watched that. If you haven't, it'll be linked down below. But um, this is one of the dresses I tried on in that haul. I'm gonna see how it looks with this. I almost hit myself in the face. I'm gonna see how it looks with this too. Ow. Yo, I got my nails done today and I hate them. They're so bad. So this is what it looks like under that dress. Um. Now, I know it doesn't give tons of support, but I don't think it looks bad. And like I said, I'm like very comfortable right now. Um, this is the back. Let me show you guys the back. Um, you can't see it, can you? I have a tight ass bra on. You can see that mark. But you can't see the bra. And even if you could, I feel like you could adjust the bra. You could turn, like pull it down or something. And my back fat don't look horrendous. Like, because the bra is like supporting it. I don't know. I feel like I just found my new favorite bra. What do y'all think? I really like this bra. It's super comfortable. It feels like I'm like not wearing a bra. Like I know it has underwire, but you can't really tell it's there. <laughs> Honestly, if I think I purchased more of these bras, this is my favorite bra right now. And the titties are moving. <laughs> like they're moving. <laughs> to me, it looks fine. I don't know. I mean, like I said, it's not the best support, but I don't know. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. I feel like it doesn't look that bad. This is a sad view. Okay, I feel like it doesn't look that bad. What do y'all think? Well, I'll have it on. I'm gonna try it on with like some more dresses to see, but I don't mind it. Except for reference, I'm in a 44 triple D um, and I got a 2X. So they're pretty forgiving with sizing because I would think I would be in a three, but like I said, I got a two, um, and I even have space in this. It's only $24.99. I'm going to link the website down below if you guys want to check them out. When I ordered, they only had black and a 2X, I believe. Yeah, I believe they only have black, but they have like nude and white. I think I'm going to order another black one and a nude one. <laughs> Um, but this is not sponsored. I just wanted to try a new strapless bra because I hate mine and I know there's other larger chested women out there that deal with the same thing as me. So I thought I would share and give my first impressions and I honestly, I'm not disappointed. But that's it for this video. Let me know what you guys think down below if you would purchase this bra. I highly recommend them. And like I said, this is not sponsored. So this just real. I like the bra. I'm gonna wear it. Okay, um, but yeah, that's it for this video. Let me know what you think down below. If you're gonna purchase it, if you like it, like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.